Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. More storyline action. A third reminder, just because I can, you can skip this poop if you'd like by just going into the description and clicking on the next timestamp for the next operation to get to the next operation. What is going on with Secretary Anderson here? Oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Not good at all. Huh? What is this? Another letter? Emergency. Pempty, huh? Cold name Thursday. Yeah, if you could didn't tell by now, the gilts are named after different days of the week, basically. So that means that there's seven different kinds. And sadly, he's been infected with guilt. And we have to do something. We have to check out this guilt. And wow, that was a quick story sequence. <laughs> 4-6, the first step. Here we go. Yes, I would. Why do you even ask? I clicked on it, didn't I? <sighs> Next! We're gonna find out what kind of guilt it is. And yeah, sadly... Oh, it's a new strain of guilt. So we gotta find the cure for this one now, just as we did for the Tatarti, even though that one was ridiculously easy. <laughs> even though that I was pretty much like running on instinct in the last part, I was looking through the footage and I was like, why did I keep switching to this tool? Why did I keep switching to that tool? <laughs> it was like I was playing against the... Um, Kiriaki that I was describing just slightly earlier into the last part that I was comparing the Tatarti to uh, Because they kept going inside the organ. Oh Don't worry. We'll figure out a way to treat it. Don't be ridiculous. This is trauma center a medical drama and That means there's got to be a happy ending. Well, perhaps <laughs> Huh, what's you? Oh, well, hopefully they'll work, but if they're experimental, yeah, if It'll definitely help others with, with, with whatever results it will get. Might sting a little. That's to uh, say the least, that's for sure. <clears throat> so, let's go inside and check it out. So, this is Pempty. Yeah, that was what we got inside that letter there. Evidently, they knew that he was infected by their new strain of guilt, and that's why they sent the letter to Caduceus there. So let's check out what the heck this thing is and see if we can do anything about it. Do everything I tell you to do. I was waiting for that line. <laughs> yeah, you basically have to follow his orders because that's all you can do really for this operation. Because we don't know anything else and he Which seems to be operation? more of an expert at this than we are, so... Might as well trust them. Here we go! Doop. And let's see how high the vital cap is. 99, okay, that works for me. What? Why do I fail on that so often? <laughs> anyway, whoa, what is this? It looks kind of gooey. Ugh. Ugh. All right, let's detach it. Scalpel! Scalpel! Okay! No, nothing? Okay, let's laser this sucker. Nope. Nothing, I guess. Gel! Gel! Gel everywhere! Gel in the... No, no, I'm not gonna say anything more than that. <laughs> go, go, more! Oh, yeah, yeah, I had to run out the gel. Okay, what, are we, what else do we have? It's not good for the human body. File of blue liquid, huh? Okay. So I guess we should inject this even though it's not exactly safe. Hmm. It did something. How about the pink stuff? Okay. Yep. Come on. What else do we have? Yellow stuff? Okay. This kind of looks gross, but... Oh, oh boy. Oh, stable. 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 Stabilizer. Okay. Well, it's called a neutralizer. Go, 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 go. There we go. And then, let's bring them up, I guess. I, 
I didn't mean to do that. I was, I was injecting it into here, but this grew up, I mean, grew a little bit and got in my way. You can't inject the, uh, um, the stabilizer into the gel-like stuff here. That's kind of a weird exception. Okay, blue, yellow, what? Blue and yellow alternatively? What? Okay. Why, why didn't I get that reaction when I put the whole vial of blue in there before? I don't know. <laughs> Now, needless to say, this isn't a hard operation in the slightest here. And okay, pink and the neutralizer. Oh, okay, and there we go. See, I don't, I don't get why I didn't get the okay before. I thought I would, I would have got the okay if I finished adding in, you know, the. Uh, excuse me, the. Uh, what am I trying to say here? Those, those first two combinations, like one right after the other. I was expecting I would get the okay. Uh, after I put in the second one, but that wasn't the case. I was evidently supposed to get it for the first one, so my bad on that one. And there we go. There must be some truth to those rumors. What are you talking about? I. B. Pro. How many times do I have to say that in these walkthroughs? See, I got a B rank, even though I missed a heck of a lot. <laughs> and let's see what he else he can do here. Maybe he'll find the cure as we're waiting. And medical research, let's get this sucker started. This is, this operation right here, if I'm not mistaken, is more of a puzzle, actually. Sort of like that uh, Tritty and the Time Bomb one. Like, uh, this game, as I said, has a bunch of puzzle aspects to them. So there's a little section of its DNA that can be altered. However, he can figure it out. So he's gonna ask me for my help for whatever reason. <laughs> I don't understand why, but okay. <laughs> I actually forgot how to do this puzzle, so this is gonna be pretty interesting here. I'm pretty sure you, to, in order to get the excess rank, you have to do it pretty much flawlessly, like at least thinking he's the idiot because he's implying it. <laughs> anyway, you have to do it within like five seconds or something like that, which is ridiculously fast. But if you memorize this one, and then, you know, you know what to do, you should be able to do it quickly. Oh, I remember this puzzle. It's a thing of put it together as fast as you possibly can sort of dealio. And let's just see if I can get this. Okay, did I do it fast enough? Did I do it fast enough for that excess rank? If I don't, I'm going to have to redo this one. Yes! No! That was a really quick one, so maybe I'll redo that for the fun of it. I don't know. <laughs> But I did that pretty dang quickly. I'm, I'm good at puzzles like that, except when they get like an excessive amount of pieces and then it gets really annoying. Otherwise, when there's a small amount of pieces, I can visualize it pretty good. Okay, let's just try this again for the heck of it before we go on to the next one and see if I can get that excess rank, just for the fun of it. And this time I will skip the storyline as well as, as his jabbers right here with the minus button on the controller. Whoa, look at that text fly! I can do this! <laughs> yeah, okay. okay. I gotta get gotta get this piece there, that piece there. Gotta do it really quickly here. And boink, boink, boink. No, 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 no. I think I'm gonna lose my rank here because I was rushing. Dang it! Ah, let's try it again for the fun of it. I really want that excess rank for the sheer you know, fact that I can get it really quickly. Here we go again. Puzzle attempt number three. <laughs> Here we go. And grab, drop, no, freaking. Eh, eh. Was that fast enough? I doubt it. <laughs> and what did I get? What did I get? Curse you. Number four. <laughs> okay, concentrate. Okay, I think that was about as fast as I could do it while keeping up a steady pace there. And yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay, the next step, here we go. I just wanted to do that for the fun of it. Boink. It's a it's a five second operation if you do it properly. So it's it's like, why not? <laughs> it's just for the fun, as I've said. Why did I repeat myself? I don't know. So now we got another little test thing that we're going to be doing here, and hopefully it'll work. It's safe to assume it's impossible to remove directly. He's got a lot of good lines, I have to say. He, like, he uses his sarcastic attitude for a good amount of humor, I have to say. Mm, 
Okay, we can do this. No problem. No, we, no objections. We can, we can only do what we can do, basically. And did I just repeat myself again? I think I just did. That makes me sad. And the cut that we already, or I should say the uh, incision that we did to him just a little while ago has already healed up, surprisingly. <laughs> Alright, now we gotta get this stuff into it. Yep, like that. And looks like it's working, so perhaps we've got a shot this time. Oh, I don't like those little tumors there, so we gotta get rid of them. Shell them off. And there we go. Looking good. And hello, what is this? It's mesmerizing. It hypnotizes. I am under its power. Okay, um, that's enough with that. So let's just laser this sucker and get rid of these as long as I'm at it. And... Uh, it appears that that didn't work, so let's just try this again. Keep going, keep going. And laser, 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 laser. Okay, now let's try cutting it. Pull it out! Alright, we got the core out. It should work. No, it didn't! Crappers! Ah. And he's also got a sassy mouth on him. <laughs> So evidently that didn't work either, and we've got to find some other uh, way to do this. And I maxed out his vitals, evidently capped at 90 now, that just shows that his condition is worsening. And... Boink! There we go. Hey, stop swearing! Stop being unkid friendly. And... A rain curses! Oh well. <laughs> Guess I just didn't do it fast enough, oh well. Because I don't think I got any misses there, did I? I didn't really pay much attention to my misses, and what do you mean you made an idiotic mistake? It's just the thing of, you, you were trying to do something, and you were just a little hasty. <laughs> but still, you tried, and that's all that matters at this point in time. Here we go, next one, progress. Hopefully we'll be making progress. I think this is gonna be another puzzle, so... I think, you know, I think these puzzles represent like a DNA strand or something like that of that Pempty virus guilt thing. At least I think that that's what it was representing. I kind of forgot already. <laughs> you know me in my memory and I'm always so spacey. I'm, I'm more about the uh, gameplay than I am for the storyline in games. If you didn't get that before, because I believe that when a game starts turning into a movie, it's pretty much no longer a game. <laughs> When games start to pretty much become movies and books, that's when I'll pretty much quit buying new games. <laughs> just saying. But this uh, storyline in this game, you can just like skip through if you wanted to and just do the operations. But I'm not going to do that sort of thing because the story in this game is pretty intriguing. And it does give the operations like a little more tension to them. Like it's like, so to speak, the last... A last minute that you can do some of these some of these things, you know. Well, this is taking quite a while, I have to say. <laughs> and I really am running out of commentary for these story sequences. Maybe I'm just getting burnt out for the day in commentary for these stories because I don't really have much else to say. And that's kind of a bad thing, I have to say. Running out of commentary, not all that good. I could talk about what they're saying, but there isn't really much more to say than what they're saying, other than me spoiling something or putting stuff together, <laughs> you know, for you, just to explain some stuff. New puzzle, puzzly wuzzly, two puzzles now. Oh God, yeah, he's he's not very confident with his puzzle solving skills. Um, in this first one here, you can do it while they're talking, like do it in your head. While they're chatting about it, like, see right here, I have the choice to look at all these pieces here and see what I want to do before I do it, if I wanted to. <laughs> but on the in the case of the second puzzle, you'll have to memorize that one. But for this one, you can do, do you know, just like look at it right now and just check through the pieces and see what you want to do. Um, let's just see, I'll just put that there. No, wait, that can't go there. Oh, eh, see, when the puzzle gets bigger, that's when I start messing up on things. Let's see if I put that there. 
No, that's not gonna work, is it? What if I put... <laughs> Maybe I should cut ahead until I find the solution or something like that. Hmm... Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, I think I got it, but it took a lot longer than I expected. <laughs> Probably a good minute or so that I cut forward there, but that's your solution. Memorize it and do it quickly for the excess rank. Same goes with this one. Let's look for the solution. Oh, 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 there we go. Awesome sauce. And I don't look well. <laughs> As I said, Derek is not very confident in his ability to solve puzzles, despite him being able to figure out how to, how to defeat Strains of Guilt. Then again, it's actually Angie that seems to tell him what the poop to do in operations, so maybe that's not the case. Maybe it's Angie or Victor here that's helping out to do stuff, and it's not actually Derek. Maybe it's just Derek that has his pro-surgical skills. I'm not sure at this point. <laughs> Oh, how can you possibly say that you got sick because you got older? Come on, we're talking about a bioterrorist attack on you. You couldn't have prevented that if you were young, no matter what you did. So don't blame yourself, man. <sighs> anyway, as I said, don't forget to memorize the second operation and just do it quickly. Well, that's all I'm going to do for this part. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when we do Prolonged Struggle.